Over the past 46 years, the Silicon Valley Monterey Bay Council, Boy Scouts of America, has recognized distinguished citizens who have made tremendous impacts on our community. This year, the Committee of Past Honorees has decided to highlight scouting alumni who are hard at work helping their fellow Americans through the challenges of the COVID-19 pandemic. Their experiences in scouting have prepared them with the capabilities and leadership skills required to meet the demands of a global crisis and an ongoing need to devote themselves in service to others. Hi, I'm Dan Rusinowski, the voice of the San Jose Sharks, and I'm also an Eagle Scout. Scouting left an impact on me like it does many young scouts, and that impact carries forward into our communities as those same scouts enter the workforce, take positions in government, and become our first responders. Nathra Srinivasan is a local explorer scout who has embraced that responsibility during the pandemic. I am a medical explorer, and I aspire to be a doctor one day. Um, so I started the Make a Mask Challenge. Um, our goal was uh, 1,000 masks. We far exceeded the goal. Um, we were able to scale this into a national effort. People were stepping up and trying to, you know, make a difference. And that's what I think is really important when you're part of a community that you give back and you try to uh, make your world the very best that it could be. Jason Krasow is a 26-year veteran with the San Jose Fire Department. He is using his scouting background to make a difference on the front lines of the crisis. I was probably more prepared than most for this because of my early on in my career, we'd always been warned that a pandemic would happen, you know, and we had specific training. But I believe that a lot of that came from uh, my background with emergency preparedness and first aid and scouts. When I started working towards my first aid merit badge, it, something inside of me clicked, and I actually understood the concepts and uh, had a real interest in it. Scouting is recognized as the most effective youth leadership program in America today, a program that has evolved with our communities over generations into the pinnacle of youth leadership training. Bella Krasow, Jason's daughter, is a fourth generation scout and is working toward becoming a third generation Eagle Scout. I think teaching the life-saving merit badge in first aid and learning the life skills needed in medicine and my dad being a medic at summer camps all those years, it's really motivated me and driven me to want to pursue medicine myself. Scouting inspires youth to service, to giving back. As a teen, Justin Imamura led a team of volunteers to clean up trash and graffiti in a neglected neighborhood as part of his Eagle project. As an adult, Justin has built a team of more than 700 volunteers that clean up trash and graffiti in San Jose, which they've done every month for the past three years. So uh, with COVID-19 and shelter in place, with our organization, uh, we have you know, been able to pivot. Uh, and I think that shows uh, just the leadership that I've been taught through scouting. You see an obstacle, you turn into an opportunity. And so I'm able to uh, pivot and turn our vents, which are very much, you know, hands-on cleaning up trash. And we've been able to create a no contact event where people just drive up and uh, they recycle everything. Because really, the heart and soul of the trash punks is to bring the community together around a common goal, which is blessing the environment and bringing everybody together. And uh, that's really what Foundation of Scouting is. It's bringing everybody together. And it's not just the local community that benefits. Mike Bangs is Vice President of Facilities at Oracle. What I've learned about Eagle Scouts, even in later in life, is they constantly want to give back. One of the things I look for on a resume is the extracurricular activities that that individual may have had during their life. Something that makes them just a little bit different. And I always look for that individual that has Boy Scouts, and especially Eagle Scout, as something in their resume that really differentiates them. Because I know when I see Eagle Scout in someone's resume, I am getting a quality person that I can count on and will do the job. You probably don't realize how many Scouts you work with and engage every day, but you certainly recognize their spirit. Scouts are everywhere around you, doing the work that needs to get done and leading others to service. Scouts like Palo Alto City Manager Ed Shikata. 
I suspect that the lessons of learning from the older scouts and then being able to teach the younger scouts is something that I didn't even realize I was being taught. Be prepared and do your best. Right? Certainly uh, in a city, being prepared, you never know what's around the corner. I mean, who would have thought a global pandemic? Uh, or issues around uh, reawakening to social justice issues, or whether it be earthquakes or uh, economic uh, crises or, or economic success. You know, any or all of these things are things that in some ways in my profession you need to be prepared for. So the basic lessons around scouting of be prepared uh, definitely come into play and again do your best. During the current crisis, scouts and scouting alumni are stepping up and stepping in, taking action and providing strong leadership to get the job done with the passion and humility needed to do it well. I, I wear the uniform that I'm wearing now because I got used to wearing a uniform. Because when people see this uniform, they know that I'm only there to help. And when people see a scout uniform, they think the same thing. So I think that was my biggest turning point was, was actually getting to work on first aid. And like when I got to jump in and actually do first aid at summer camp on people who actually needed it. And um, some of the mentorship that, we, that I've had with some of the doctors and other paramedics in the field and um, you know, nurses that we have in scouting, I really got to get my feet wet in the field before I even stepped foot into it. More than ever, America needs leaders like Adnan, Justin, Jason, Bella, Ed, and Nathra. Across generations, communities, and cultures, they are stepping up to their promise to help other people at all times. Scouting has had such a big impact on my life, and I think that it's important that others get that same exposure. Scouting is something that really sets up the younger generation for success in their future. It really inspires them to make a change in their society and make a difference in the world that we know today. We're lucky living where we live. Um, scouting is an opportunity that not everybody gets, and that's the saddest thing for me. Um, the fact that some of my peers that I knew growing up and later on in life needed scouting, like scouting was almost made for them, but they couldn't do it. So I think that any donation that helps people get into scouting that wouldn't be able to normally do it is one of the greatest gifts you can give. Scouting works, and it has worked for more than a century. Right now, scouting needs your investment keep that program alive for today's generation of boys and girls. Your investment today creates great leaders, great employees, and great citizens for the great challenges that lie ahead tomorrow. My name is Dan Rusinowski, and I support scouting. My name is Adnan Hamwe, and I support scouting. My name is Bella Crasso, and I support scouting. I'm Justin Mamura, and I am a scout. My name is Nathra Srinivasan, and I support scouting. Hi, I'm Ed Shikata, and I support scouting. Hi, I'm Mike Banks, and I'm the Vice President of Real Estate Facilities for Oracle here in the Bay Area, and I support scouting. <laughs>